If I fell in love with you, would you promise to be true? Chocolate and the neurochemistry of love and romance. Love, an emotional roller coaster. It brings us from the peak of ecstasy to the depths of despair and anguish and back again. As Sigmund Freud said, when one is in love, one is very, very crazy. What causes these intense feelings? Our ancestors cited drugged arrows, spells, planetary forces, charms, and potions. But 21st century neuroscience tells us that the neurotransmitter phenylethylamine produces the same sensation as being in love. Described as a love chemical, phenethylamine is a natural compound produced from the amino acid phenylalanine. When you have a crush on someone, your brain is drenched with phenylalanine. You experience the highs and lows of the lovesick. Possessiveness, goosebumps, butterflies in the stomach, restlessness, the inability to concentrate, sleeplessness, that delicious agony called infatuation, or as the psychologists call it, limerence. Phenethylamine is also found in many foods, such as chocolates. The phenethylamine in chocolate stimulates the nervous system, triggering the release of endorphins, opiate-like compounds that dull pain and give a sense of well-being and euphoria. Turns out that chocolate is a mood enhancer after all. Small wonder then that men give it to women by the box full. To understand the power of phenethylamine, take a look at the chemical structure of it. It is only one methyl group away from the drug methamphetamine. A methyl group is a carbon with three hydrogens around it. When we are in love, we are happy. But when things start to break down and love is no longer in the air, there's sort of a withdrawal effect. I used to call it the lost puppy dog syndrome, but in medicine, it is now called heartbreak syndrome. Consider the effects, sleeplessness, decreased appetite, feelings of despair, despondency, depression. It has actually been shown that the heart itself diminishes its ability to contract. An aspect of treatment that I recommend is to eat chocolate. This will definitely ease the pain. Again and again, we try to capture that loving feeling. Love is the drug, no question about it. We think we can play with love, but in reality, love plays with us. It is far more powerful than we are. Love helps us find the true meaning of our lives. And whatever the meaning of our lives it may be, it has to involve love. You know you